something. And we went round every single aisle where James was like, just pick <laughs> something. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Nice. How you doing? Hello. You <laughs> First off, Nan. Mm -hmm. Why did you drop that necklace in the ocean at the end of Titanic? <laughs> You were so cheeky. <laughs> what is your full name, original, you know, like your birth name? Moira Josephine Ma. And what is it now? Maureen Gordon. <laughs> <laughs> Why the change of Moira to Maureen? Uh, that was my foster people. Right, okay. They changed from Moira to... Yeah. I don't think it was legal, but... Because <laughs> nothing was that, that legal in Ireland then, was it? Of you course, know. Yeah. What were your parents' names? <laughs> my, my own, my own, own parents. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Ellen and Joe. Okay. Uh, why did they give you away? didn't want me. <laughs> well, that's heartbreaking. <laughs> really? Really. How many kids did they have? They had two boys, two girls. But they get, tried to give Betty away as well, but... No, okay. like a... With the Kellys, but they didn't want her. Oh. Mm. Mm. Do, you, do you remember anything from Ireland? I can remember <laughs> up to when I was nine, nine and a half. Yeah. What's your earliest memory? Oh, I don't know. Probably when I made my first communion. I, that's the one thing that does stick in my mind, yeah. Do you remember, like, what you were wearing and stuff? Yeah, I was all in white and oh. veil and everything, yeah. Wow. Yeah. Because yeah. mm. you did it in sort of classes, you know, that through the church. It was lovely, yeah. And you're a devout Catholic now, then? No. <laughs> I still believe. I think I still believe that. Yeah. She had four kids. <laughs> Five. Five? Who are you forgetting? Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not like Betty. Betty is yeah. all for yes, religion. Yeah. 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 What were your new parents like? Uh, she was lovely. She was a lovely yeah. lady. He wasn't so nice. No. Oh, yeah. I had a kitten and. Uh, you got in the mood one day and kicked it over the roof of the next door's house. <laughs> <laughs> I never saw it again. Was, well, it, a was it a bungalow? <laughs> <laughs> no, right over the, the roof it went. Was he yeah. a big guy? Or no, guy? tiny little man. Was he? Yeah. But he was, he was wicked, you know, really oh, wicked man. No. Was Alice nice? She was nice, yeah. Oh. yeah. She absolutely adored your mum. Oh. She yeah, used to yeah. buy her everything, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Do you remember much of the war while you were there? I can remember some of it in Liverpool. Yeah. Yeah, with planes flying everywhere and everybody running for shelter and yeah. things like that, yeah. I remember you telling a story of that you were ducking between shop fronts because you oh, thought... Yeah. Could that you was tell that? Could yeah. you tell that story? That was like? just after we moved there. And, yeah. and uh, some friends of my, my parents that were then uh, lived further up and I was going up to see them and I saw all these which I, they told me were barrage balloons, and I thought they were bombs. <laughs> <laughs> and I was ducking in and out of everybody's doorway. <laughs> <laughs> but I was in now and a half. <laughs> when, I, when I went up there, they just couldn't stop laughing. <laughs> <That's amazing. laughs> was it like a really snap change of, you know, like rationing and then just... Oh, yeah, yeah, it was horrible at the times, you know. But we moved into a house in... in um, where did I say we went? Liverpool. Yeah. Uh, people were just leaving their homes and just going, and you could just move into a, into a house. And that's what we did. And I, I remember they found all this jewellery and everything down oh. in one of the cellars, you know. Yeah, yeah. How sad that people mm. would just leave. Mm, like mm, just... Mm. It's it wasn't a nice time at Battle of Britain time, not there. Yeah, yeah. You know, it was horrible, yeah. So, see, so you were never evacuated or anything? No. Yeah, no. Yeah. That's lucky. Mm, I wouldn't have liked to have been. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's some right. of the kids were all right, that, mm. but some didn't have good places. Yeah, did yeah they? it was hit and miss, wasn't it? Mm. Mm. 
What was like the thing you were excited to eat again after rationing? Like, was there something that you were like, ah? Potatoes. <laughs> <laughs> Probably, because that's what I like the most now, don't I? You know. But I can remember that I always, re in the wartime, you had dried egg. Oh, yeah. Oh, and I used to love that. I, I won't look at an egg. <laughs> Like I egg. don't like eggs, and yet I used to eat all the rubbish, didn't I? <laughs> you didn't know what was in it, did you? Because yeah, I mean, I mean, when I do an egg and I see any little bits, everything has to come out. You know, I pick every tiny thing out of it. You know, uh, and I wonder when you went, what you did in the war, what was it? Yeah. You know? You're funny. Didn't do me any harm anyway, did it? No, clearly no, not. No. I mean, what you 89? Yeah, I'll be 90 in a couple of months. <laughs> Don't remind oh, me incredible. if I make it. <laughs> Amazing. Oh dear. That's so cool. <laughs> so cool. Obviously, you went back and met your biological mum. Have you ever met your biological dad? Did yeah. You? Yeah. A couple of times I met him. He wasn't with her. Right. No, no. She was already married to somebody and he left and came to England oh. and left her with two boys. Ah. Oh. Yeah. I did meet them. You know, one's dead now, but. Well, they both did, but one died very young. Oh. Yeah, and um, yeah, and I met my father. He was nice, yeah. really nice man. I could understand why he didn't stay with her, you know. Because your biological mum wasn't too nice, right? Sorry? She wasn't very nice, your biological. No, no. no. Horrible. Well, we think she might have been the crossover. Really? Yeah. So what a cousin of ours told us. That was the last time I was over in Ireland, a cousin of ours came to A lady there. of the night. Yeah, yeah. she liked the men. <laughs> nice, and she liked money. Oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah. She did write to Grandad once and asked for some money for Betty, but I don't think it was for Betty. You know. Ooh, what mm -hmm. So you were better off being really? given away yeah. then? Yeah. Poor Betty had her all her life. Oh. Even when she got married, she moved in with Betty. Oh, no. Mm -hmm. oh. Yeah, so it wasn't good. Well, thank God for Alice, eh? Thank God mm. for Alice. Mm. And so was Alice desperate for a little girl, having three little boys? Yeah, because she had three boys. I think that was probably it. Yeah. 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 Were you spoiled, do you think, compared to the boys? I, I suppose I, I had a good life. Yeah. I do remember that, you know. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't, never wanted for anything, you no, know. Yeah. Not to say your mum never did, did you? Because <laughs> she was so good, wasn't she, too? Oh. Oh. Hard-working lady. <laughs> Lovely. Who was your first boyfriend? He was an army lad, young lad. Okay. Yeah, dad owned a load of shops and whatever, you know. Oh. He was very nice, um, but a bit, bit posh. <laughs> <laughs> you were down here after that. One. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, well done now. I think the first time I took him home, that put him off because my brother John was in. And he used to swear a bit, and I think I put him off. <laughs> what was his full name, your brother? What was his name, your brother? Is he John Joe? John, yeah, John, John Joe. Joe. Yeah, John Joseph, yeah. John Joseph. Such a, such a Irish. Irish name. John mm. Joseph Kelly. Yeah, John Joe Kelly. Yeah. Oh. And what were your other brothers? Frank and Jimmy. Oh. How did you meet Granville? I worked in a cafe in Gillingham. Yeah. He was a taxi driver. We met when I was 18, we got engaged when I was 19. Got married when I was 20. Aww. Yeah, yeah. Quick movers. Mm. Yeah. Is this the first thing Grandad said when he saw you? Your body is made up of 70% water and I'm thirsty. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> you oh, my <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> Where did you get married, you and Grandad? Registry office. He wouldn't get married in a church. Ah. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Um, Chatham. Chatham Registry. Because Grandad refused the church. Mm. <laughs> he didn't. He didn't like any any fuss. He didn't like a lot of fuss. Yeah. <laughs> it wasn't a big wedding, was it? <laughs> no, it's only a few of us there. Yeah. Oh. Did you have any bridesmaids? <laughs> no. No, just had witnesses. That's Did what you, you do. Flowers? Can't even remember <laughs> these flowers. All that. It's a long time ago. Isn't it? Seventy day. years ago. Did you have a honeymoon? No. We only had eleven pound between us the day we got married. <laughs> <laughs> and did you have any 
you live in one room, weren't you? Yeah. Two, ro two rooms in a house with an old lady who was horrible. <laughs> oh, didn't like us having electric lights on. Oh, yeah. We weren't allowed to have too many baths and ah, she was terrible. How long were you there? Not long. Yeah. <laughs> Not long. I moved in with a friend oh, good. and her husband afterwards, yeah. What's Grandad's full name? Harold John. What did he go by though? Tim. <laughs> and why? I don't know. <laughs> it was when Tim he when was, I met when him. He was on the buses. Sorry? I used to call him because he was tall, and I used to call him Tiny Tim. Tiny Tim, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, and like I'm guessing he, he liked it. He so that's like Harold. no, he, he hated Harold. Oh, it was after one of his uncles, but um, oh. yeah, he, he just thought he should have been called something different. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. but. And what's his birthday? What's Granddad's birthday? Fourth uh, of November, and he was f four years older than me. Also, oh, twenty-six. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Nineteen twenty-six. Mm -hmm. What were his mum and dad's names? Eva and Fred. Here. Do you remember Eva's maiden name at all? Oh, God, I should do. I have got a name, it's not but Perry. it's... No, Perry? No. Perry. 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 Oh, yeah, because okay. yeah, she originated from gypsies, didn't she? I was going to say, and what lifestyle did they lead? Mm. Were they in the house? Yeah, they yeah, the house, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but mm. she used to run in Gillingham High Street? Yeah, just, she used to sell papers, didn't she? Yeah, selling newspapers, yeah. I think yeah. I was probably about three. Mm. We used to stop and talk to her sometimes, yeah. didn't we? Yeah. She's on the call now. Yeah. Mm. And she used to go to jumble sales, buy up loads of clothes to go home, wash them, and, and then sell them. <laughs> mm. Were they nice? She was all right, yeah. I mean, she was a bit rough and ready, but right. yeah, but she was all right, yeah. yeah. What jobs did you have then? What have you... I've got the Bridge Hotel, that's where you... I, that's where, at the little cafe I worked was belonged to that. Um, the bridge hotel was across the road and cafe was the side. Yeah. I remember the first morning I started there, I, w I was about 16, I think. And then I didn't realise that it was a friend of my mum's that ran it. Yeah. And, I, and I, she left me, she said, I've just got to run over to the hotel. And while she was gone, suddenly all these sailors and soldiers running and I hid in the kitchen. <laughs> 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 I couldn't face them all. Yeah. How old would you have been? About 16. 16. Oh, <laughs> a bit scary. Yeah, maybe a bit. 15 or 16, I don't oh. know, you know, but yeah. Terrifying when I saw the face. <laughs> and, oh. I, thought, I can't stand there with all that. Oh. <laughs> Do you remember what Grandad's jobs were? Got a bus driver and a taxi driver, so he liked driving. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Those were scary. Yeah. The last one, he was worked for Bells for years. He was a manager there, wasn't he? You know. But before that, I, I can't remember what he did. Um, he worked for Richmond. Oh, Richmond Sausage like Company, yeah. Yeah, yeah. To, to like, um, yeah. Because I remember going in. I mean, I had the other kids and Debbie, and she was only about two, I think. And I'd taken her into Gillingham, into Gillingham for a, a bus ride, you know. Yeah. And she saw her dad's van, oh. and she went, oh, daddy, daddy, daddy. And I said, all right, we're going to see him. And we went in the shop, and he was chatting away to one of the girls behind the counter, you know. <laughs> and, and she goes running up saying, daddy, daddy. And the girl said, oh, I didn't know you had any children. I said, he's got three more at home. Thank God she's spotted eh? Of granddad in military uniform. So what was he within the military? He was a military policeman. Did he enjoy it? I think so. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I didn't know him in those days. That was yeah. before I met him. Yeah, but yeah. Did he actually ever? He didn't go to war or? No, no, no. No, no. no I think that was it, wasn't it? Yeah. <clears throat> what are you most proud of? Nothing really. <laughs> what am I proud of? Having a good family? Great grandchildren? Great great grandchildren? <laughs> Got enough of them? Yeah, <laughs> just a few. 
Out of all your children, grandchildren, great grandchildren, why am I your favourite? <laughs> I don't have a favourite. I love you all. Other than me, yeah. <laughs> I'd... Uh, Sean, uh, Julie, Sean, Timmy, in three three years. Yeah. Then I went five years and had Debbie. Yeah. Mm. Then I went eight years and had Gary. Oh. Only reason having enough other babies is because I love babies. Mm. I would have had more. Would you? Yeah, yeah. Out of all your children, who was the easiest to raise? Debbie. <laughs> yeah. I never had any trouble with your mum. No, not at all. She was... Uh, never wanted anything. <laughs> if I go out shopping, I say, uh, what can I bring you back? No, I don't want anything, mum. No. She was such a good girl. She was. Not just saying it because she's there. She knows. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Depends on who's in the room at that point. <laughs> What's he like? Wink again. <laughs> no. Go on, do it. Go on. And, and who was the, the hardest? I don't know. I think all the boys were about the same. Yeah, well, I loved all my kids, really. Yeah. yeah, I did, yeah. Can't say I didn't, you know. Yeah. Yeah. They were all good in their own way. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, you didn't have a bad bunch, did you? No, no. When did you learn to ride a bike, now? <laughs> <laughs> I never did. <laughs> Your granddad bought me a bike and <laughs> took me on the top of the lines to teach me. And, and I'm going along all right and somebody come on another bike wobbling and he fell in the ditch. <laughs> and he could ride. <laughs> so after that, I, I only ever had a photograph taken in the garden leaning up against the wall. <laughs> On the bike. See, so that must be somewhere. Yeah. You've got that, have you? What, the picture? No, but I've seen it before, so it must be. It's probably in one of the albums or up in the attic, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Who's your favourite, like, singer and stuff? Did you ever have a crush on, like, the Beatles and things like that? Oh, I love the Beatles. <laughs> we used to have Beatles nights. All, all us women that lived along the Little Bourne. <laughs> Always had that. Always Who was there. your fave? Who were you in love with? I don't think I was. No, oh, I just liked them all. Oh, you know? oh, yeah. no. I'd take them all. <laughs> <laughs> that looks cool. Do you have a favourite film or movie? Uh, it's a Wonderful World. I love that film. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You've never seen it. Mm -hmm. Is there a black and white one? I got I got it in both is black that, and white and the coloured. Where is it Christmas Eve? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Mm. Mm. Moon landing. Do you remember the moon landing? Yes, yes. What was that like? That was exciting. Yeah, no, yeah, no. Yeah, Did you that. have like people around, or was it just no, your granddad? No, just us, us and yours. Yeah. Mm. What did granddad think? Or now little telly. Oh, what was it literally like? A tiny box. Small one. <laughs> Do you believe it happened? Sometimes, and sometimes I don't, you know, <laughs> yeah, yeah. A lot of people don't believe it, do they? Yeah. yeah. I hope it happened. Yeah, I, I think the people that don't are miserable. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, you want a little bit of fairy tale in your yeah. life, right? Like, mm. just... Yeah. So Luke's trying to think of a way to finish this. Oh. Um, Sorry, you're like... Yeah. Well, why you don't you wait and finish like... it with my funeral? <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> you finish it. <laughs> You've got one. <laughs> what, just, just, just some footage of fire, yeah? <laughs> yeah, she's gone to hell. <laughs> Thank the Lord. <laughs> it's fine, man. You had your oh, communion, dear. you'll be fine, apparently. Um, <laughs> oh, oh, dear. How can we finish it? You wanted it? a heartfelt ending and Nan's just made it comedic. <laughs> yeah, you can finish it yourself afterwards. That's a good idea. Well, basically so the old bat's gone now. <laughs>
What a lovely life I've had. Yeah, it's amazing though, Nan. It's incredible. Yeah. yeah.